Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is your Austin Realtor, David Mercedes, coming back to you from the Six Creeks community here in the city of Kyle. And we're touring this Wichita floor plan by Coventry Homes here in the 70 foot section. It is a two story home featuring five, bed, featuring five bedrooms, four bathrooms, over 3,400 square feet of interior space and it's being offered at 774. So as you can see right here in the front, we do have some brick siding and also some hardy plank. We do have pool gutters and we have some mature landscape. This beautiful home has tall ceilings as, and it backs into the green bills. Let me give you just a quick 360 here of the area before we head inside. Right here at the front door, we have an eight foot tall door with glass inserts right in the middle. And we have, so, we have the keypad access when you enter the home. So immediately to your left, you will have the office that we're gonna be touring in just one minute. There's a bedroom and access to your garage to the right, ded uh, dedicated dining, formal dining there to the left. But let's get started right here at the heart of the house. I'm gonna give you a quick 360 as always, and we're gonna get started with the tour right here in the kitchen. Just put my sunglass, sunglasses away. We have a great size kitchen island with built-in seating. I love that the seating is quite deep, so if you have long legs, that will be, that is amazing. You have enough room for four, two, five people easily in there. We have quartz countertops and it is a working island. So we do have a deep stainless steel sink plus this Moen gooseneck. Now we do have lots of storage right under the cabinet and we have this Whirlpool dishwasher in there. We have luxury vinyl plank flooring throughout the house and I love that there is enough room between the island and the counters. Once again, there's lots of drawers, lots of space for storage. We have 10 foot tall ceilings and we have this five burner Whirlpool stove top. Quartz counters, we have four different outlets in there. And we have this beautiful ash color backsplash. Stunning, stunning kitchen. Now, here on this side, you have space for your fridge and right across from it, you'll find the microwave and your oven. This is an electric oven for what I can see. Now, if we go to the other side here of this kitchen, you have the breakfast nook. It is so bright in here. We have six windows if you count that door as one of them overlooking the green belt. Just check out these views. It is, an, it is amazing, it's beautiful. Okay, so we're gonna, we're right here right now. So let's go outside. Let's take a look at the covered patio back here. Just ignore the two dead birds down there. Okay, so I'm gonna, Show you, the, show you the green belt from here. Look, this is a hundred feet wide. This is the size of this yard. It's just phenomenal. Let's aim the camera a little bit further up so we avoid seeing those birds. Uh, yeah, pretty spacious covered patio, tall ceilings. And yeah, I'm gonna give you another once over here of the green belt, phenomenal. So no neighbors back here. Huge yard. I consider removing the, the birds from there, but no, the only time that I will deal with something like that is if I'm defending the honor of my wife and my son. Otherwise, no, I'm not doing that. 
and there you have your uh, gas line out here for your grill. So let's head back inside so neither you or I have to think about it anymore. Okay, back inside we are. And oh, I really wanted to get that over with, so I'm glad it's over. So living room space in here, just look at how tall these ceilings are. They're gonna be 19 to 20 feet tall. We have these six superbly large windows in here. And just look at how many windows you have total in this space. It's super bright and it's really nice in here. Now, let's go down this way into the primary bedroom. You have one of your two thermostats in there. Now here in the primary bedroom, we have carpet flooring, tall ceilings once again, and we have a total of six windows in here. You also get a ceiling fan. Here we go. Let's go and take a look here. Okie dokie. So, what do we have here? We have tile flooring, dual vanities that are mirror image one from the other. We have more in faucets. That's your closet back there. Let's take it, let's finish the primary bathroom first. Lots of storage, they're not soft closing. Right down this way, you have the toilet and they added that window in there. Nice view if you look to the outside. And then we have this walk-in shower. Oh, I love the pattern that they use here. And you only have, we have the single shower head and then some seating space in there so you can ponder some thoughts, think. <laughs> now, in here, we have this large walk-in closet, carpet flooring here in the closet, your communications panel. What's behind this door? A linen closet, that's what's in there. Now, let's head back outside. God, that is beautiful. I could stare at that all day. I just can imagine chilling back in there, grilling, not having to think about those two birds. Okay, back in the kitchen. On this other side of the kitchen, as you'll see, you have this large pantry, same luxury vinyl plank flooring, and then you have a small butler's pantry right in there. Now, as you saw early on, if, on this side, we do have a formal dining space, three windows, the two on, on the outside, framing the large, larger one in the middle. Now we're gonna head back to the front of the house. We're gonna take a look at the study. And then we'll have one more bedroom, one more bathroom, the three car garage, before we head up to the, to the second floor. So, home office, love that you have these six windows total. It's so bright in here. The east is somewhere that way, so you have plenty of light here in the morning. I oh, forgot to mention, we are in a cul-de-sac, so I wouldn't expect to see much traffic in here. We have a full bathroom with tile flooring, more and faucet, and then this gray. I love the color of this gray. It reminds me of the Toyota Tacoma uh, cement color, which is one of my favorite colors of any cars. Then 
We have this bedroom here at the front of the house, carpet flooring, two windows, 10 foot tall ceilings. A total of one, two, three, four, five, six outlets in this bedroom. And then you also get this closet in here. Should have opened these doors when I was turning all the lights on for the video. Now, on the other side, you'll, you will find this laundry room, tile flooring, same tall ceilings, and this is a good size laundry room. Now, before we head over to the second floor, let's take a quick look at the three car garage. We have an electric panel right there. The garage door is there, as it comes with a garage door opener. And then you will park the third car here on this side. We do have a tankless water heater. Once again, this is placed inside the home, which is phenomenal for the cold winter months. Mud room, so once you come into your home, this is what you will see first. And this is the way that you will walk into the main floor. Now let's head up to the second floor. We have three bedrooms, two bathrooms, plus the family room to see up in here. Okay, so we have a great family room slash flex space, three windows, tall ceilings. You do have that ceiling fan in there, four recess lighting in here. And I love that how much nature you get to see around here. Huge plus if you ask me, love nature. Access to the attic through both of those doors and here you'll find the second thermostat. Now there is another full bathroom in here. So there are two full bathrooms here on the second floor, this one being one of them. And then there is also a Jack and Jill bathroom connecting the other two bedrooms. Tall ceilings, carpet flooring, just a single window. And this room is at the front of the house. Now, now, let's take a quick look at this closet space before we head over to the other two bedrooms. Oh, and just in case I didn't tell you the price of this home, just real quick, 101, where are you? It's 774, it was listed at 830 recently, but it had a $56,000 price improvement. So if you've been waiting for prices to improve, if you've been waiting for rates to come down, well, those two things have come to pass. So if now is the right moment for you to pull the trigger and become a new homeowner, then follow the link in the description down below and I will negotiate aggressively on your behalf. Now, this is the Jack and Jill bathroom, tile flooring once again here in the bathroom and then You'll have this closet. Frankly, I'm surprised how small this closet is compared to the Perry homes and Highland homes that we've seen. It just feels unnecessarily small. It's, and it's very tight here in this Jack and Jill bathroom. Granted, I am filming, so your experience will be slightly different if you're not holding <laughs> that gimbal like I am right now but just, it does, it, it does feel a little bit tight in here. And then you have another small closet down that door that I won't bother to show you again, because it's rather disappointing having the, such a small closet in such a beautiful house. Okay, okie dokie. That's, that's all of it. Uh, let's just take a look down here, down this way. What you will see when you're looking down. So I hope you enjoyed the tour. 
be sure to like and subscribe. Um, thank you for stopping by and I will see you on the next video. Cheers.